Hello everyone, this is Lakshman. Welcome back to another video. In the today's session, we are going to discuss about uh, which one is a better technology, either SQL DBA or uh, MuleSoft developer for non-IT candidates. Not only non-IT candidates, even computer science candidates also eligible to do these kind of jobs. But especially uh, who are having some confusion about uh, whether uh, which one I should choose, which technology I should choose, either SQL DBA or uh, MuleSoft uh, for non-IT students. So I am going to cover in this session uh, what are the main responsibilities of uh, SQL Server uh, DBA database administrator. And parallelly, I will explain what is the main responsibility of uh, MuleSoft developer. One more, we are going to compare like uh, uh, what is the what are the skills required to become a SQL Server DBA and other side what are the skills required to become a MuleSoft developer. If I choose a SQL DBA what is the future scope? What type of uh, designations I should reach? What is the exact uh, career goal for SQL DBA? And other side what is the future scope of MuleSoft developer? So we will cover all these details in this session. So don't miss watch till the end of video and don't skip this video if you want complete information about sql dba and MuleSoft, then i separately i'm going to upload the complete details of sql dba uh, one video and uh, MuleSoft one video so in this session i'm going to explore which technology is suitable for non it candidates either sql dba or MuleSoft. First, let me discuss about SQL Server DBA. Here, DBA means a database administrator. So, you are going to work as an administrator for data. So, whatever the data is maintaining by organization, you have to, you are going to take care about the data. That means you are going to perform database installation and configuration. And also, you are the responsibility to take the database backup. And also, you are responsibility to take the database restore whatever the data backup is data backup copy is there that data you need to restore again based on the requirement and for which person you have to give permission to access the data and which person you have to restrict that person okay so you are the person you are the person to take the responsibility of the complete data so that's why you are calling as the administrator database administrator Okay, so you are the one of the key role for data in your organization. In the opposite side, we are going to discuss about MuleSoft. So MuleSoft is a integration platform. MuleSoft is a Java based integration platform. It allows the developers to transform the message or data different platforms or different components. That means you are going to connect business data or applications or different devices across the premises. It might be premises or cloud computing environment. So MuleSoft you can also call ESP. ESP stands for Enterprise Service Force. So it allows the developers to integrate the applications very easily and quickly and securely. So you might be working on one platform and one software so you can easily integrate that platform with other software and other platforms that to securely okay and one more advantage of MuleSoft uh, suppose if your application or production working on premises basis and if you want to integrate your entire product and entire data into the cloud environment then MuleSoft is the best integration platform you can easily integrate into the cloud computing environment and it is also very easy so i can say in simple words what exactly the MuleSoft is going to do you know it simply transform the data on different platforms now you may have doubt uh, is there any coding is required for MuleSoft? minimal coding is required why this minimum coding is required you know to perform the data transformation here few technologies are using to exchange the data between different platforms so those are nothing but uh, like uh, soap rest soa and also different data formats like uh, json xml csv okay along with these skills if you have one object oriented programming knowledge then it is a very good advantage to you like uh, java 
so if you know java basic knowledge then it then it is a very very added advantage to you for your better career growth and bright features as well through data transformation in the mule soft we are using a data view and mule soft expression language mainly used for data mainly used to perform data transformation then what about sql dba skills you should have good understanding of different databases and also you must have good knowledge on different operating systems as well like linux unix and windows operating systems as well and also you should have good knowledge on uh, configuration installation and installation and configuration as well and uh, you should know uh, how to do performance tuning as well you have knowledge on any scripting like uh, shell scripting or bash scripting if you have good knowledge on uh, scripting then it is a very added advantage to you for sql server administrators let's compare the uh, what are what are the average salary for sql dba and uh, mule soft developer so compared to sql dba mule soft developer is you get more package i mean high package compared to sql dba suppose if you are uh, suppose if you are working as a sql developer you have 3 years of 3 years or 4 years of experience in sql dba then you will get around around 6 to 9 lakhs package for sql dba if you are a 3 years or 4 years of experience candidate it is also depends on your uh, skills and your entry performance and your uh, where you are working now let's come now let's talk about mule soft developer if you are so if you have three years or four years experience as a mule soft developer then you can expect up to uh, eight to eleven lakhs package okay so it is also depends on the company and the location and based on your skill set based on your problem solving skills uh, uh, it, okay so compared to sql dba mule soft is a little bit high now let's talk about what is the uh, feature scope of sql dba Suppose if you upgrade your skills by learning uh, like uh, database engineering related uh, technologies like uh, uh, any NoSQL uh, database like MongoDB or any other one and also if you and also if you are able to write complex queries as well okay and also if you know any big data related technologies and uh, uh, cloud related technologies then you can easily become in the future uh, like uh, you can become a data engineer or uh, uh, big data engineer as well it is up to you only it's based on your commitment based on your uh, plan and your strategy as well so you have to gain the complete knowledge about uh, database skills and uh, associated skills then you can easily transition from administrator to database engineer let's talk about the uh, future scope of mulesoft so mulesoft is also is a good one but you have to upgrade your skills uh, uh, any uh, programming language or scripting language then you will have better feature because it is a uh, integration platform so you should not expect a more career growth related to mulesoft so if you upgrade your skills by learning any programming language and database skills then you will have bright feature on this platform as well. my conclusion words are uh, about uh, which technology is uh, preferable for non-it candidates you know suppose if you have good technical knowledge and problem solving skills then better to choose then better to choose a mule soft developer for non-it graduate okay and uh, it is also very so it is also very uh, easy it job you can choose you have to do some hard work and commitment and another side sql server db also one of the most uh, one of the most demand it job suppose if you are very fashion towards uh, database administrator jobs and uh, uh, data related work then uh, then better to choose sql dba okay and you will have better career growth as well in the future if you are upgrading your skills by learning big data related technologies okay and uh, learning any uh, scripting language as well so both are have good job opportunities and uh, both are having a better career growth okay so based on your interest and dream job you can choose the technology okay so that's all guys and if you feel this video is very helpful then don't forget to immediately share to your friends and also don't forget to hit the like button we will meet with one more useful content video thank you very much